Puppy family. This is Zoe and the gang in five weeks. And right now they're getting a little bit of nursing at what I call on the drive-by, on the fly. They're eating primarily from the pan, but they're still doing a lot of nursing, which I encourage up until the very last day if they want to, because it obviously gives them the uh, immunities from the mother's milk that they so desperately need, and which is important for them. Um, the purpose of the puppy shots is to uh, let the puppy immunity evolve gradually, to build up the immunity gradually. So uh, it is my feeling and my uh, veterinarian concurs that it's good for them to have that immunity up until the very end, as much as they possibly can. It's, um, studies have proven that they actually get a huge surge, I think the first 12 to 14 hours after they're born, but that they get the most amount of their immunity at that time. But still, I think that it's very important as long as she's tolerant, and she is. She's very tolerant. They're doing a lot of floor time. Uh, the things that we have on the floor, obviously, are the interactive toys. I have a little red bed, which helps encourage and let them play to uh, interact with the depth perception. Same thing with the little bins that I have. They crawl in and out of those. Most of the different types of toys that they have are to encourage that. I have added a kennel to the, to the floor, and that's to help encourage the den-like activity. Now, they went ahead and added their own little den, and they've been getting underneath the stool that Zoe and I to get in and out of the bed, and they've been hiding underneath there. So that's just letting me know that they're ready for that activity, and that's an important thing for them to feel secure. We're doing really well with uh, learning to make eye contact and getting on their back and fostering trust, so they're doing well. The families that were visiting with me this weekend got to see firsthand and help participate with those tasks, and they saw how well we are doing with that. Now let me see if I can introduce you to the gang. They're playing a little bit now. Personalities are going to come out this week. Of course, our pack order is going to emerge. They're playing, mouthing. Uh, biting at one another, engaging play. Let's see what we got here. This is Mr. Lime Green. Hi, Mr. Lime Green. And who is this on the bed? On the bed is Mr. Dark Green. Hi, Mr. Dark Green. You on the red bed? And let's see. We've got two over there playing. That looks like Zoe. You're in the way, baby. It looks like Mr. Orange. It's hard to tell with her fur now. Yeah, that is Mr. Orange, Mr. Orange, <laughs> Mr. Orange, and getting up on the bed here is Mr. Blue. Come on, Mr. Blue, you can do it. Good. And coming up now is Mr. Yellow. Hi, Mr. Yellow. Mr. Blue got on, got off. Lime green again, lime green again. There, you're like moving targets. I can't <laughs> you barely get you. Um, Miss Purple's right here. Hi, Miss Purple. Pretty face. And who's behind you? Behind you is Miss Light Pink. Hi, Miss Light Pink. Tails are wagging. Miss Hot Pink. There's our girls. Zoe, you need to run from them. There's Miss, Mr. Red. Hi, Mr. Red. So we can't leave anybody out. That's Mr. Orange again. All right, who are we missing? You're all behind me or under my, trying to get in my lap. Let's see here. Mr. Blue again. Mr. Yellow again. Where's Mr. Black? There's Mr. Black. Hi, Mr. Black. That's Mr. Dark Green. Hi, Mr. Dark Green. Hi, pretty face. Hi, pretty face. Don't you be biting, Mama. This is light pink. You gonna play? Oh, Mr. Red. We didn't show you. Mr. Red. Come here, Mr. Red. Hi, Mr. Red. Hi, Mr. Red. I think we got everybody. Let me see. I'll try to catch you if I'm not. There's Mr. Black up on the bed. Let me pan back. Mr. Black on the bed. Mr. Red is climbing on now. One of the girls there. That's Miss uh, Pink. Hi, Precious. Will you scratch it? Let me get the ball over here for you. A lot of interaction. Hi, gang. Hi, Just look at you. I've got some keys on the floor for them, which helps them with the teething. It's something that they can pick up. It's a little puppy teeter keys. 
Who's that up there? And the girl. No, it's Mr. Red, excuse me. I'm moving in it so I can see. So will you knock the video out of my hand? I know you're such a lover. When I call her, they all come. Okay, baby. Let's so I can see the babies. You're right in the way. Got two of them on the bed now. Let's see. Mr. Dark Green's on the bed. There's Miss Purple by the pink pig. Trying to get everybody. <laughs> They're trying to get drive through service. I don't know. The drive through might be closed, gang. The water we're picking up at 7 o'clock, starting them on their schedule. And that just puts them in place to start keeping them um, dry at night. And obviously, they're physiolo physiologically incapable of staying dry at night. But that just starts putting them on their, on their routine. And I've got the water on the floor for them now. This is it. Mr. Dark Green's got the ball. But they're doing a great job of interacting and playing, so we're going to see quite a bit this week coming about. Okay, this is his hot pink. Hide his hot pink. Hi, guys. There's Mr. Red. And here we go with the ball, with the playing. Good babies. And Zoe, of course, is patient. She's going to be teaching them some bite inhibition and some manners. She's going to be doing that with some just uh, body postures, carriage of her tail, the way she tucks her ears. All right, gang. I think we got everybody.